Hello and welcome to the tutorial that will uh, explain you how to get your uh, Epson Stylus TX117 scanner to work. Uh, actually the printer is working very well with the uh, drivers for uh, Epson Stylus TX110. Uh, That's the easy part. Uh, but the scanner is not working at all, so we will have to download the drivers and install them manually. So, uh, so first step is to browse to Avasis Company website. It's uh, avasis.gp. You will find all, all the all that I'm saying now in the descriptions of this video, so don't worry, you can copy and paste everything. Okay, uh, so here in the website we'll have to choose English. Uh, click on Linux driver. Scroll down and click on All-in-Ones. Uh, now scroll down and locate the TX117 printer model mark it scroll down to select your distribution it's Ubuntu in my case uh, 10.04 use it links um, country doesn't matter, connection environment doesn't matter, location for the product doesn't matter. Click on next. Now you will see a printer diver. Skip, you don't need it. Uh, scroll down and locate the scanner driver that's what we'll have to download here um, we have uh, a depth package i scan data so click on it and choose to open with a package installer okay wait for it to download okay so the package installer uh, will ask you if you want to install the package click on the install, in my case in it's reinstalled because I already have the, uh, this package installed uh, so wait for the installer to finish the job then close and, uh, and the web page Scroll a little bit down and uh, locate the iScan package. Uh, it's also the 32 bit package. Uh, choose this one that says for Ubuntu uh, Hardy or uh, later because we use Ubuntu Lucid Links. Uh, the same. Click on it, open with a uh, package installer, same ins instructions, click to install the package, wait for it to finish and um, uh, now uh, I would uh, recommend to reboot your system. And, uh, after the reboot you will uh, find um, in applications menu in graphics uh, this item image scan for Linux click on it here is the nice program ok uh, so here in uh, you have uh, configuration options you have no idea about it um, you can choose the resolution what 
whatever you want. Uh, the default is 300 dpi, it's pretty much enough. Okay, so um, now the next step is just to scan your documents. Click on scan. You have the option to select um, where you want to store the file. So um, click on desktop and uh, uh, another option is to choose the file type we'll leave it PNG uh, click OK and uh, you can hear my printer my scanner is starting to scan the documents OK it uh, so um, basically that's all it's just uh, uh, frozen for a couple of seconds and then it goes back okay scanning is in progress good luck